So I hope that you're all well. Um, so yesterday we had the one-on-ones. Um, -on -ones. um so I think the overarching theme for almost every one on one was that people, um, trainees need to start um, communicating more. And I think today is, or the stand up is a good way for us to start that. Um, I said it several times that um, we'd all like to see more engagement and interaction and not have to call out everyone's names. Um, so before we start, and I want volunteers today, does the rest of the Dean Academy team have any announcements? So just a couple of announcements from my side, just reminders on the contracts, uh, contracts, deposits, and guest talk. So we really need that in order to proceed. So uh, if there's any questions, we're 100% available but we need to get that sorted out yesterday. And looking forward to the uh, second part of our guest talk happening just after the stand up at 10.30. So we're gonna have to finish up on time and go straight into Cosimo. And I also really enjoyed talking to about half the group yesterday. It was great to hear how people are doing and looking forward to this being a cultural, a turn in our cultural um, approach to the training. That's all for me. Um, Arun, I'm not sure if it's my connection, but I think you are breaking up. Um, can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Could um, you hear me? Can everyone else hear me? Can you just... Your connection is good, Karen. Let me know in the messages. Oh, okay. I can hear you now. Um, connection is good. But I missed a bit of what you said. Don't worry, it wasn't that important. <laughs> if, I, if everyone else heard, that's fine. But they, I'll, I'll just recap. I was just saying the contracts uh, due yesterday, the deposits due yesterday, and uh, we have a guest talk starting at 10.30 with Cosimo. So super important that everyone joins. Okay. Are you able to do it or is your is your connection too poor? to run it, the stand-up today. Um, I can't really hear anything, so it might be my side. Sure, so why don't, why don't we just get started then? I can just jump in and carry whenever your connection is solid enough, then you can take over. But uh, let's hear from everyone. Love to hear okay. what people were working on yesterday, what they're planning today and any blockers. And so I've been able to see you, but one other thing, we'd love to hear any, um, maybe one thing that everyone learned that they're gonna do differently after yesterday's one-on-one. -on -one. So we'll just go quickly through the group. Uh, Binyam, go ahead. Can you hear me? Yeah, good morning. Okay, good morning, guys. Uh, so to give you an update on my team's uh, progress, uh, yesterday we've been trying to sort out all the courses that have been developed by different uh, uh, teammates into a unified uh, system uh, ready for deployment. Uh, we've been struggling with uh, saving the model we've managed to develop in the end, uh, uh, but I think it's a solvable issue. Uh, we'll be working on that today. Uh, other than that, uh, we still haven't managed to uh, make our model accurate, uh, but uh, we we have uh, uh, we are sure that it's, it has to do with the hyperparameter tuning, uh, and uh, since our machine is not able to handle the, all the ten thousands of the audio samples, uh, we're gonna have to keep trying, keep on trying uh, to tune the model on the AWS machine. But for now, we're, we're just uh, moving forward with the model we have since uh, the deadline is approaching. 
So thank you. Anyone else from group one want to make a contribution? Actually, it's group five. Yeah, you're right. Sorry, I meant uh, the first group to speak. So group one in a different, different ordering. No, you're right. I, I'm just making fun now. Um, anyone else from Group Five who wants to speak? This, who else is here from your group? Opinion? Let's call them out. Matilda. Hello. Good morning, guys. Good morning. <clears throat> um, I didn't quite hear Binyam clearly. I think his microphone, his um voice was too low for me to hear but um so far we've been working well together we just um managed to train our model so we've been trying to <clears throat> we've been trying to get our our word error rate to zero or as close to zero as possible um we haven't had um, much success with that so we decided to just go on with what we have so currently we're trying to save the model and then um yeah continue with the um deployment bit um creating the dashboard that you see and then work on our reports so so far so good yeah. are you learning are you learning matilda how do you feel about the learning yeah the learning it's it's, it's great what can i see it's been nice i'm learning so much from my peers um actually this morning we just had a meeting just before this meeting and we managed to to um use ml flow um successfully and well i haven't um successfully done that before so i think that's a plus for me i have learned that today you can see so yeah it's been a great learning experience learning from each other and yeah benefiting a lot thank you great um, <coughs> michael maron abba salom jeremy anything to add Maron, go ahead. So, uh, good morning, everyone. Good morning. Uh, there's really not anything new I can say uh, to add to Beanie and what Matilda said. I just want to, I, I just want to say that we're working well together and we're really trying our best. And everyone's uh, effort is a lot in this group, so I appreciate all of them. And I hope we successfully submit this week's challenge. So, thank you. Great. How is the how is the one on one? What's one thing that you picked up from the one on one? Uh, the one thing I kind of picked up from the one on one is that I I need to work on the technical stuff more. So mm -hmm. I'm trying to do that, involving myself and pushing myself to work on those tasks as well. Mm -hmm. uh, just Matilda said this morning we were working, uh, in engaging on the ML flow. So I I was working and learning from my peers. They were showing us around. So. Uh, that's it. Okay. Great. Okay, we'll go to Martin, group uh, three. Uh, all right. I don't know whether you can be able to hear me. Yeah. yeah, uh, yeah. All right. Uh, that's good. Uh, so. A microphone or something. Oh, okay. Uh, let me reduce my volume. Uh, it's okay. I'm just making fun. It's fine. <laughs> Okay, yeah. So, uh, yeah, yesterday we did the one-on-ones. It was good. Uh, we, I, I got to learn a number of things, uh, technically, non-technically, um, managerially, time management, all those things. Uh, they are very good things to learn, and uh, I think it was something good. And uh, I'll also uh, try to come through also to help in, in my team, to help my teammates wherever uh they may feel they need help yeah that's one thing that uh, i've learned then uh, another thing is that uh, with the project so far we have been able to uh, do the modeling uh where it's able to predict uh like uh, uh from an audio file just to give it an audio file like it's able to give you good uh predictions uh so the one that uh, we just want to ensure it's getting good predictions is the amharic one uh that's maybe the only part where we'll finalize on the amharic one and then uh we'll we'll be good yeah uh so that's it for our team uh otherwise i think that's that's all from our side yeah okay 
who else from group three would like to go? Rafa, Kevin, Doug Maui, um, Endowert, no, Dizzy, no, Biruk or Amal? Anyone else from group three? Biruk, would love to hear from you. Yeah, good morning, everyone. Good morning. Uh, so, um, uh, we are trying to uh, complete everything uh, before the deadline, and we are actually um, trained the uh, Swahili, uh, uh, our model with Swahili speech uh, data set, and we, 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 we got a good result. And we are on our way to train for Amharic data set right now. And uh, at, we, we, we are trying to um, uh, get uh, uh, a minimum result for uh, w, WER. Uh, so th that, that's what we are uh, working on by now. In the other, many things are actually uh, completed. And uh, regarding the 101, uh, I learned uh, where, where to focus and just uh, to, to succeed uh, on, on the future career. So I, I, I got a number of uh, suggestions from you, from you uh, to first. And uh, so uh, that was very uh, interesting for me. OK, Rafa, let's hear from Rafa. Hi, Aaron, everyone. Morning. Morning. Um, like they just said everything, but I know that it's about the practice in itself. And yeah, so for me, is say is um, so from the one by one uh, on an, on one track, it's uh, it was very obvious for me that I, I need really to improve in the technical. I mean, I knew it, but when you just hear it, and uh, like uh, from someone who is in the field and like they see what you are doing, it's very different. So yeah, I mean, yeah, that was the point that I I found from yesterday meeting. Uh, I need to improve really much in that uh, in the technical. Other thing is uh, about this uh, challenge for the ASR. It's like, I'm, I'm not sure really how to just say because um, it, it's like, yeah, I mean, they did, they did, because I, I, I won't say that I, I had contributed as much and um, I was attending the meetings and so on, but it's still like the gap was just holding me maybe from understanding much of what they said. Um, but I'm going through the code and I'm trying to organize it myself so that I can understand it better. And uh, yeah, uh, so far, so good. And I'm starting writing the report today so that I just can pick up the submission deadline. I mean, one, one tip I would have for you is when there's things that you don't understand, you should always ask, write your questions down mm -hmm. and share those. That often helps a lot. Yes, but when it's like a big, like, yeah, I'm doing so, I'm doing so, and I'm asking them, I mean, Perak, Martin, Amal, everyone in the group, but it's still like when you feel, you feel like the gap is still kind of big, I need to sit down and just like um, do something myself. <laughs> right? It's just like eating an elephant. It's still one bite at a time. Um, you're starting maybe from a different level of preparation. It doesn't mm -hmm. mean that you won't get there. So don't, mm -hmm. you have to be realistic in your expectations. Um, exactly. So, so even if you write these questions down now, when you pick it back up um, in July or August, at least you remember what it is that you knew and what it is that you didn't know. Okay, okay, perfect. Yeah, okay. Um, let's go to group uh, two. So, test five. Okay. Hello, everyone. Good morning. Good morning. Okay. So, uh, uh, update on the yesterday's uh, progress. So, yesterday 
was not so uh, productive day because uh, it needed to uh, be online. Everyone needed to be online, but uh, some ha had a network issue and we couldn't uh, get online, but uh, we are positive that uh, we would finish everything by today. Uh, only the prediction part is left and uh, uh, we are positive that we will uh, finish it by today. Uh, and uh, on the one-to-one -one, uh, uh, meeting, um, it, 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 it gives, uh, I already know some of the comments that I got. Uh, I saw it on the 10 um, website as well. So uh, yeah, so it, it, gave, it gave me some kind of uh, direction to look for and uh, to uh, go on about it in the next coming, coming, in the coming weeks so that I can, I can improve those uh, areas that uh, have been mentioned on the meeting. And yeah. Okay. Thanks. Uh, who else from group two? <clears throat> Abel, is Abel here? I saw him at some point. Abel, do you want to go ahead? Hello, everyone. Good morning. Good morning. Uh, uh, we were attempting uh, to conclude the model evaluation yesterday night uh, and uh, determining whether it's near to actual value or not. And uh, we then directly moved to uh, dashboard deployment after the model metrics uh, were finalized. Uh, so that's what we have on the technical side and uh, about the one-on-one -on -one meeting, I think it was a, a good experience to get a feedback and uh, to ask the questions so that we can improve on the suggested advices. So that's what I have. Okay, uh, let's go to group one. So Remat, is Remat here? Hello. Hi, Ramit. Good morning. Uh, our progress is just going in medium. Okay, we are happy about special our modeling uh, prediction results that we're doing our bit. The dashboard is going well, but uh, we'll see what happens today. We'll try to finalize what we have and submit our submission at the right time. Okay, anyone else from group one? Um, Salam. Uh, okay, uh, can you hear me? Yeah, we can hear you well. Uh, okay, uh, yesterday we had a meeting uh, uh, to check up on our progress and uh, the dashboard team, uh, I think they are almost uh, finished and they are waiting for the modeling team so that uh, we could finish the prediction part and uh, so that we could integ integrate it uh, in the dashboard and we are going to have a meeting later on uh, to see um, uh, what kind of progress we made. Um, some group members, I think, they have uh, made some kind of progress on the prediction and uh, we are going to see and finalize what we had. And on the one-on-one -on -one meeting, uh, personally, it was a uh, great experience for me. I got um, great feedback and on the areas uh, I need to improve and uh, uh, I'm working on them and I'm, I'm, really glad, I'm really glad for that. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Um, let's move to group, I think the last group is group four. So we have Danait, Jonas, Tia, Daisy, Gezahen, Hikma and Amon. Is Danait here? I don't see tonight. Daisy, do you want to give us an update on your group? Um, yes. Uh, so good morning, everyone. Good um, morning. So for my group, we have been able to make um, progress. Um, the backend team is uh, set. We're just waiting for the model. Um, same as uh, you, uh, the front-end team. So we will be meeting later today to just um, see the progress that we have sort of been able to make with the model to decide on what would be the best fits for the final um, model, after which I think we will be on track to do our final submission and start working on the reports. About the one-on-one -on -one yesterday, as I said, I think I'm very grateful for a platform where feedback is given and um, received. Um, 
for me, I was able to note the areas I need to work on, which were just really improving on my technical skills and getting to ask better questions. Yeah. You're, you're on mute, Aaron. Thanks. <laughs> Is Hikma here? Uh, no, don't see her. Anyone else from Group 4? We people are having challenges with power and connection from time to time. So it's also been hard to meet. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not sure what to say on that. Um, anyone else from Group 4 who wants to make a contribution? Who else do we have? Gazan? I guess I can. No. Am Amon, is Amon here? No. Are you the only one from group four? Yes. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah, I mean, nothing else from my side. I don't know. You have a value. So just as an update, people were asking about hyperparameter tuning, trying to get the word error rate uh, down. Mm -hmm. And I think there are some concerns about actually getting an effective model. So I don't know if you want to make a, add any comments or is there any um, help or solution available? No, it's probably I didn't understand clearly the problem, but it's uh, so maybe one person can they just explain in one minute again just what is the issue with hyperparameters? Maybe Binyam, you had mentioned an issue. Yeah, uh, the problem is uh, we're not able to run the <clears throat> modeling on the entire data set because we're running it locally. Um, for some reason, my machine is not working. Uh, and uh, uh, today, we, we decided just to try uh, uh, other ski and access uh, the the base machine through the my teammates key and we will run it on the, the AWS and uh, using the GPU might help uh, in generally yeah, I mean, it's... hyperparameters. Yeah, the hyperparameters. Yeah, basically if you're if you're not using GPU just then no no chance. Yeah um, we're using uh, a small uh, number of uh, epochs in the, the batch size also quite limited. Yeah, I think it's so, with, um, so it's like I would I would spend most of my time doing making it work in the GPU than just uh, like kind of doing it the the usual the the way that you're doing. I would I would really still try hard. I think the you know the very uh, I would say the main element you're missing it it's it's one is analysis but i think you know the key aspect is actually to make it work like in an environment you are given so it's good that you guys have attempt but i would have liked to see that some of you really spend time making it work you know doing whatever is necessary it's that element that's essential so if it's at work and you, you know you're kind of taking shortcut because it just works in one place and then you want to maintain it there. You know, you, you're a business question that you haven't addressed. Right? So I would be still um, dividing work and somebody should just really work on that and, and make it work. Because at the moment, I think whatever you're doing, you're not gonna at all get a good result. And that would be even close to a one hour work let's say so I, i'm not sure how much you could run actually in your i mean if your laptop has gpu good gpu then it's fine but i don't know how much you you were able to even process out of the 24 hours so is that only you or the whole team didn't manage to to use the machine Yesterday around the morning, um, it wasn't for working for all of us, but uh, 
uh, in general. Uh, I think it's only for me uh, for uh, the machine is not working. My instance is not working for some reason. I'm not sure. I mean, it's the same instance within the whole. Uh, everything has that. I mean, every if in your instance, I tested it and it was working. So and you have also a pseudo access, right? So you could you could install anything you want. So yeah, I I, I mean I think it's so don't bother much about the hyperparameter if you don't have if you don't make it. Um, I think just like it's not gonna be it's not gonna be fast at all, right? Even just to run one model, let alone running multiple ones. But I think yeah, in the remaining time that you have, like what I would optimize is to be able at least to make it like I would still divide it the, the task and other people complete some of the tasks that are already given, and then at least one or two really work on making it work on the GPU and run at least one final good analysis, right? Um, and just see uh, at least you know that would give you certain idea whether you're pre-processing and others were happy okay we'll try Okay, so I think we'll wrap up the stand up. Um, let me stop the recording. We'll wait for the guest talk to start in one minute. But just as a reminder on the announcements, we have the contracts, uh, we have the deposit payments, and guest talk. But if there's any questions, one thing that's really important for me around the one on ones, it's the cultural shift from doing stuff on our own towards um, making progress as a group, and also the prioritization of what's important. It's not only about, I mean, this is a good example. Or just getting the model to work is it's almost the forest for the trees the point is not necessarily to get a model that works but to use the resources that are available and to actually figure out how to do it and if you're not sure people please ask don't suffer in silence it's i can't emphasize that enough so let's change our mindset from i want to get a good grade to i want to learn together with other people and a big part of that is communication talking chatting So let's start stop stand up and we'll start with Cosimo.